Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in again. This will be the the last uh, early season ice report on any of the bodies of water around here until after Christmas. After Christmas, we're supposed to get a really good cold snap. I think uh, things are going to get real positive at that point. However, today uh, I did take one more look at another lake. A lot of you people have been waiting for it. Lake Onalani up near Reading. Uh, I took a ride up there today and uh, I'll be telling you what uh, what I found up there in just a minute. Lake Onalani is a pretty good sized reservoir that supplies the city of Reading with water. One thing about it is it's that you're not allowed to have a boat on there. No kayaks, no boats, no no nothing, no watercraft. Back that I can remember in the late 70s, early 80s, this lake produced some of the best pan fishing, perch, crappies. Um, it was common to have three, four, five pound bass all over the ice. Now somehow, and I think it's because of the no watercraft restriction, that this lake continues to produce, not like it did back then, but it's still pretty darn good for uh, panfish and bass. There's a few northern pike that you see every year. And uh, now, of course, snakeheads, but that's usually in the spring or summer. So anyway, went up there today. Let's take a quick look at it. I found some positive information. Here we go. This is Lake Onalani. We'll be there in just a minute. We'll take a look at the water. And it's going to be the Peters Creek area, which everybody is familiar with. And no doubt, it is the very first place that usually gets safe ice before anything else. Very popular. It's not unusual to come here and see 30, 40, or 50 people right in this general area. So uh, here we go. Let's take a look. Well, I didn't expect to find any ice here on Peters Creek, but this is the, uh, the most popular spot. And uh, it will freeze first because it's pretty much shallow. The whole uh, cove is anywhere from uh, two or three feet. And if you go up far enough, you might find eight. 10 or 12 feet but for the most part it's very shallow it's very weedy and it is the hot spot for first ice around here uh, water temperature is about 35 degrees and I'll show you some something to be uh, happy about here is the edge of the lake we definitely got a little bit of ice on the edges. That is a very, very, very positive thing. Now it's a little wind blowing out there today, so of course there's no ice. But this is ready to go. And we're supposed to get a day or two of rain coming up and warmer temperatures, but after that it's gonna the temperature's gonna plunge. This place is gonna lock up. And I predict we'll be on here first week of January. And uh, if anybody's crazy enough, they might be on even before that. You know, strap a couple of two by fours on your feet and uh, go on out there. I'll wait till it's good and safe. Okay, so Lake Onalani is right on the verge. All it needs is some cold weather and calm nights. Uh, next couple days, it is going to do some uh, raining and warm up a little bit but after that boom we got it it's going to lock up uh stay tuned right after this i'm going to give you something to, something pretty good to look at right here i'll put another one up right here check it out if you like it don't forget to hit the subscribe button and i'll see you in a week or two with hopefully reports of safe ice see you later